The fight over oil and gas drilling along our front range has come to another small town, and many people are afraid of the future there. Anna Darko bought the land in Decono in Weld County. The property is just about two miles south of Firestone, where a gas line explosion killed two people. Dominic Garcia was at a community meeting tonight, and Dom, sounds like a packed house. Jim, a full house, and that's because these drilling sites are going to be pretty close to homes. Now, there are a number of concerns here, and the people here in Dakota think this is going to have a huge impact on this community. And it just gets you emotional. In a packed room, the people of Dakota made sure their voices were heard. I'm terrified. We all should be. Why are we letting this happen? How can they do this? Dozens came to show their opposition to oil company Anadarko. City says the company bought four plots of land and plans to develop over 70 wells. Concerns range from health issues to home prices. As soon as they start doing this, I'm going to lose 10 to 15 percent of my property value. Uh, well, it took my wife and I years to squirrel away enough money to come up with our money to get the down payment to even buy that house. Also on their mind, the explosion in Firestone that killed two people last year. Anna Darko owned the well linked to that explosion. It really caught us off guard and was uh, kind of a, a shock to the city. City officials say they're not happy about the plans, but their hands are tied. They are allowed, yeah. Um, they own the mineral rights below them and are permitted by the state to do that. And they also own the land on top of that. In a statement, Anna Darko said, Our objective, consistent with our approach in all municipalities throughout the DJ Basin, is to work cooperatively with the city of Dakono to safely develop the oil and natural gas resources we all need in a manner that respects the city's plans for growth and well-being. And the city says right now they're working on an operator agreement with Anadarko, something they say will be available for public review in the next few months. In Dakota, Dominic Garcia covering Colorado First.